I'm Mark Alviar, co-host of HBO's Sex Inspectors. Welcome to You Ain't Right. Today's whack job is Tony from Cincinnati. Listen to him. Hey Mike, my buddies are always bragging that they're swinging 10-inch clubs between their legs. Yeah, right. Will my penis ever get that big? <laughs> no, and neither will your friends. Do you think they might be exaggerating just a little bit? So before you go into full-blown penis envy, get your facts straight. What do you think is the average erect penis size? You wish. Ha! Close. Yes. <laughs> I know, I know. A moment of silence for the breaking of the six-inch myth. You know, Kinsey started all that because he made his subjects measure themselves. Can you imagine? I mean, we're the people who look at a map and think an inch equals a mile. Today, trained technicians do the measuring. So here are the new rules for measuring your penis. Get undressed in a warm room. We all know cold causes shrinkage. Use cloth measuring tapes. Rulers don't measure curves. Lie on your back and start where the base of your penis meets your stomach. Do not measure from the testicles. Where would you stop? Round up to the nearest centimeter, not the nearest foot. And that's it. If you're under five inches, you have the right to be an atheist. If you're between five and seven inches, you've got the right to shut up. And if you're over seven inches, you've got the right to brag.